An innovator in Peru came up with a device that can generate free energy from the very plants that surround us. First biocharger that produces its own energy through plant photosynthesis. And it's a groundbreaking innovation that harnesses the power of photosynthesis to generate clean, sustainable electricity. We are going to explain how it works and why it's being hailed as a game changer in the world of renewable energy. The name Alinti is as unique as the technology itself. It's a fusion of two words from indigenous Peruvian languages, Ali, meaning plant in Aymara, and Inti, meaning sun in Quechua. Together, they perfectly describe the essence of this invention, a harmonious blend of nature and technology that draws energy from the sun through the natural process of photosynthesis. Here's how it works. During photosynthesis, plants absorb sunlight and convert it into chemical energy. We all learned in school that plants use sunlight to convert carbon dioxide and water into energy. But what's less known is that during this process, plant roots release organic compounds into the soil. The Alinti device contains a special cell filled with organic soil and unique graphite electrodes. Within this soil lives a community of microorganisms. These microorganisms get to work breaking down those organic compounds released by the plant roots, and as they break them down, they generate electrons. Alinti's innovative design captures these electrons using a specially designed polymer-based electrode system. Unlike traditional metal electrodes, this polymer is resistant to corrosion and more efficient at converting bioenergy into usable electricity. Think of it like a super-efficient antenna pulling in the bioenergy produced by the plant and microbial activity. These captured electrons are then transformed into usable electrical energy. It's a beautiful cycle of nature and technology working in harmony. Once the electrons are captured, they are channeled into a storage system where they can be used to power lights, charge devices, or even purify air. This process is entirely natural and sustainable, relying on the continuous cycle of photosynthesis and microbial activity in the soil. And because it doesn't rely on fossil fuels or external energy inputs, Alinti is a truly green solution. Now I know what some of you might be thinking. Free energy? Isn't that against the laws of physics? That's a valid question, and it's crucial to understand that Alinti is not creating energy out of thin air. And in this case, it respects the principle of energy conservation. The device is harnessing solar energy, just in a different way than traditional solar panels. Plants are essentially nature's solar collectors, where they capture sunlight and store it as chemical energy through photosynthesis. Alinti simply taps into this existing energy flow, capturing and converting it into electricity without disrupting the natural balance. This is why the scientific community has embraced Alinti as a legitimate and innovative renewable energy solution. Also, unlike Maxwell's device, Alinti is already a lifeline for communities without access to reliable energy. In remote areas of Peru and beyond, Alinti is providing a safe, sustainable alternative to candles and kerosene lamps, which pose fire hazards and health risks. Beyond lighting, it can charge smartphones, purify air, and even neutralize toxins, making it a versatile tool for improving quality of life.